Hey guys, I'm Simon Toast Can, and we're about to play a fantastic game called Fran Bo. I've been waiting for this game to come out for for forever, ever since it was a little Kickstarter. We played the demo of it, and I, it's just a creepy point-and-click, cool adventure. I hope you guys enjoy it, because I know I'm going to. Let's start a new game. This game features auto save. Nice. Everything's fine. It feels like heaven. It looks creepy and soulless. I see my parents. They look happy. They have a present for me. I wonder. It's a cat! So sweet and pretty. Dark as the deepest night. It's Mr. Midnight! My best friend. My only friend. We're having dinner, and I see Aunt Grace, too. I really like her a lot. Look at that kitty cat sleeping. It's Friday. My parents are going out. Aunt Grace is taking good care of me. Look at that cat just licking up that water or milk. <laughs> We're having so much fun. It's Monday night. I'm playing with Mr. Midnight. Look at that little cat butthole. But something feels real bad. Dun dun dun! Something's in the window! Oh man, a strange creature outside my window. I was looking at my window, my dog turned around. I don't like it. It scares me. Suddenly I hear something. It's mom screaming. I want to know what's wrong. A bright light shines from a parent's room. I go closer. And closer. Mom? Dad? Please don't. Jesus. <laughs> Mommy? Daddy? They are chopped to pieces. That house is like blood everywhere. I run through the woods and Fall. Mr. Midnight's with me, though. Oh, Mr. Midnight, he's got my back. He's got my butt. He's like, mm, girl, nice butt. I love this booty. Oh, I'm so mad about this booty. Oh, I run away from the booty. It's okay, Mr. Midnight. Oh, it's a person. Two people. Some hooded figure. Friend, please follow my voice. On the count of three, you will wake up. <clears throat> One. Two. Three. Fran, how do you feel? Uh, I feel like, I feel like dying. I feel like dying. I don't understand why you made me do this. Try to calm down. This is part of your recovery. Recovery? Don't you get it? My parents are dead! Oh, poor thing. Everything will get better, I promise. Better? Then let me go! That would be better! You should not tell me how to do my job. But now I have something for you, friend. Oh, really? See the desk? There's a little package for you. It's from Aunt Grace. Take it. This one? A little cut-off hand there. Mm. This is my mother's purse. Alright, open it. There's something inside. What is it? Examine. Dearest friend, this is the purse. This here is the purse you like so much. I thought you would like to have it. When I was thinking about you, I remember that you like to examine objects and combine them with other things. So hopefully you'll always keep this purse and give it all the things good to use. Never forget that creativity is absolutely the greatest gift. Alright. She's worried about you. 
I'm worried too because I'm not crazy and still here. Stop it, you're out of control, young lady. Ha! <laughs> you're out of control. I'm so tired of all this. I just want to go to my room. Yes, you can leave. But before you do, it's time for your new medicine. What medicine? I called it. It's called Duotine. It'll make you feel very relaxed. Nurse, we're ready. Anything new? Any anything new today, Doctor Darren? Nothing actually. Same visions as before. Oh, I see. Oh, I see. Here, friend, take your medicine. Okay, let me just take this medicine here. Mmm, delicious. Tastes so good. I don't feel good. Oh, oh god! Meat! Meat and heads! And a scary thingy! Ugh. Oh no, take her back to her room. And hey, nurse, don't let her take this ever again. <laughs> Man. That's actually different from the demo. Um. Beware, Franbo. If you leave the House of Madness, I will hunt you down. Catch you. And bring you back to insanity. Friend, wake up! The medicine will help you escape. I'll be waiting for you in the forest. I love you. Mr. Midnight is such a little sweet kitty cat. Yes, yeah, she is. Chapter 1, My Sober Day. Well, now we are ready to start playing the Fran of Bo. Creepy clown on the wall. Just in my... What's up with these lights? Always the lights. Now this is my brain. I'm still here. Hideous place. I have to get out of here. All right. So these eyeballs in the wall here? Oh, it takes me to the next room. Okay. Gotcha, 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 gotcha. I understand. So, now we just gotta look around and try to figure out what's going on here. I'm just looking at all the stuff. Old lady, what do you say? Hello, friend. Good to see you. Good to see you're awake. How long was I asleep? Maybe she'd be an old lady voice. Three days, maybe? Three days? Wow. It's not good. I should find my kitty. Um, I'm working, friend. Can't you see? <laughs> yes, yes, yes. I see. I see. I have some notes in the wall here. Red and tiny. You were hiding from me. Pills. Yay. I hate the monster. I have to find Mr. Midnight. I have to find him now. I miss my kitty kitty face. He has because he's afraid. He told me that the medicine would sh show me where he is. All right. I just got to find my medicine. Oh, a secret box. Shh. Nice secret box. Use the secret box. A key. It'll certainly open something. Nice. Maybe it'll open up my drawer that's locked here. Eh? Eh? Locked. Good reason. Do I need to open the key and use? Yes, yes, I got it. And there's something inside. Oh, a picture and a pin. Let's examine my picture here. That's my family and my kitty. Yay. How sweet. Awesome. What is your story? Hello, Phil. Hello. You know a way out? Right? There are many ways out. But you know, everything's locked. Indeed, but the office is the key. The office? What do you mean? I saw the doctor write a secret code. A secret code to open the yellow door? He doesn't want me to tell you. Who? Him. Oh! Oh, snap! All the doors are closed. You are a prisoner of my games. And nobody will help you escape. Go away. <laughs> Leave me alone, I hate you. All the other- Mommy, Daddy, I need you so much right now. No, I won't let that monster stop me. So the other kids can see the monster too then, eh? Alright. Let's see here. 
All right, see my bobby pin works with the door. It fits, but there are only two holes. I need something else. Okay, that's not good enough. Oh, crap. Holy moly, something fell. What's this? A hook? A handy hook. I'll save it to play pirate later. Nice. I combine that and that. Okay, no. Let's go see if I can open the door now. No, it's not right, it says. Hmm. Oh, I'm looking out the window. Ooh. Tower defense. We have you f <laughs> We have for a crazy- wait. Let's see. Or is it defense tower? I'm, I guess it's my way out. I don't think my head would fit through the window. Alright. Gotcha. What the heck was I supposed to do? I forget. Oh! There we go. Finally. Something new. Uh, I did something. Lady Nurse, I did something. See? You're not in much trouble. What is it? I was trying to look outside and actually broke the curtains. Pff, accidentally, I have to fix this. Follow me. Mm hmm. You go fix those, nurse. You go fix those curtains. I've been sitting here forever trying to figure out what to do. So, what is she writing over here? I'm curious, but the nurse is still inside this room. Better go and talk to her. I'm just trying to see if I can, like, grab any of her stuff. All right. Yep. Yeah. What's up, nurse? Something's missing. Have you seen the hook that holds the curtains? No, miss. I haven't seen anything. Well, I have to go find something to fix this, you little girl. <laughs> I'm gonna get any stuff. I'm gonna get any stuff. What is this? Oh, I keep these patches to stop blood. And I think this is where the medicine is, but it's locked. Oh my goodness, this is terrible. Why would the nurse have this? She wants to kill us all. Mmm, is, is this? This is Frambo. The patient has uh, been sleeping almost all the time. She only wakes up to drink water, but I don't think she remembers that after drinking she goes to sleep again. She hasn't been social for three days. Some kids have something. Uh, and then this. What is this? 8H. 8H. Yeah, this is numbers and letters, so 8H. Okay. Nurse handwriting. I only understand three words. <laughs> oh, poor. This is the brain. Find that trauma. Ch children damaged by trauma. And nice. Ooh, a gross coffee. Ew. Okay, so I got some new items. I have some bandages and, and that. Right, let's examine this. The pills are inside. No, I'd have to crack the code. Hide. Okay, so we can figure this out. There we go. The pills! Kitty told me these to help me. Yeah, I got my pills! Pills here, pills here. Did I just take them? Oh god! Watch your step! What is that thing? Get out, creepy creature! What is this? Hello, Miss Nurse. Ooh, excuse me, lady nurse. This may be very useful. I got something from her. Sweet. Well, thanks. Oh, she was knitting something. People have glasses. Let me just go to the next room here. Oh, oh there's, there's something creepy out the window. Can I look at it? Oh! Don't worry, they just have my head. Uh, uh, okay. Oh, a dead rabbit. Oh, are you sleeping, sweet bunny? No. It was not me. Do I get down here? No, absolutely not. You cannot, you can't tell her that. But she hasn't, though. You can't keep me away from her. The reason is more than clear, Grace. No, it's not. I want to take her home now. You can't, friends. Mental condition is not appropriate yet. Huh, so my aunt's there trying to take me. Oh, there's a fox. It was not me. Is that real? Oh dear, Aunt Grace. I wonder what she has to tell me. The doctor has no soul. I'm going home tonight. Sweet melody. What about this fox here? Oh, fox, don't cry. It's okay, Mr. Foxy. <laughs> Use my hand as a tissue. What? What does that say? There's so many things. Who did it? Who did it? Indeed. All right, what's the little boy doing? Oh God, he's like all old and nasty. Hey, young man, why are you looking at me like that? You're terrifying me. Phil is playing with his uncle, and his uncle is mad. Mad. All right, Mr. Deer. Oh God! Oh no, your head. What is this? To happiness, you can see. Alright, let's... Let's... 
Use this. Can we, do we combine these and then use on the door? Yes, to happiness. Oh God, what is that? What was that? Yes, good question. Okay, I think that I think we're out of time for this episode. Thank you very much for watching, guys. And I hope you would stick around to see more Frambo because I want to keep playing it. It's gonna be a really fun game. And until then, today's your birthday. Happy birthday! See you guys next time. Stay toasty, my friends.